Hello everyone, you're welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Oma. I'm glad to have you on this channel today. If this is your first time here, hello. If you've been an old subscriber, I truly appreciate you. Thank you for your support. I do not take it for granted. Okay guys, today I have come to teach you how to break a spell that is casted on you. This is an instant destruction of spell you will get an instant result if you are if you've been doing all right and all of a sudden things went bad you are under a spell it doesn't matter who has casted a spell on you it can come from your husband who belongs to a secret cult it can come from your family members it can come from friends it can come from families it can come from anywhere. In fact, as a human being, you should be breaking curses. You should be breaking spells. You should be removing spells that are casted on you. Ones you are aware of and the ones that you are not aware of. This recipe I'm giving you, this remedy is an instant result remedy. You don't need to wait for too long. For no matter who you are. No matter who you are. A woman called me and told me that anytime she tells her husband that she's pregnant, she'll miscarry the baby. This has been going on and she's no longer comfortable with it. I told her no problems. Give me your name. Give me your details. I'll find out. I'll find out exactly what is going on. I checked and I discovered that the person that is that is behind her predicament, the person that is behind her problems is one of her husband's girlfriends. This lady wants to come into that marriage. Is a side chick, but she wants to be the main chick. She wants to get married to the man. So anytime that this woman is pregnant, out of excitement, she will tell her husband. Her husband will be so happy but out of excitement, her husband will go and start sharing the good news with his side chicks. Not knowing that they have evil intentions. After telling them about it, one of the particular one that does this, the main side chick that does this, she will take the matter that will reach doctor. So give the woman, give, give out the picture of the woman and they will remove the child. Because she wants to, she wants an avenue where she will be the one in marriage with the man so that she will move the other woman out of the marriage. This has been going on for long. The man is not even aware of it. Every time this man will be like, babe, you were pregnant. One minute you're pregnant, another minute you have miscarried the baby. What is going on? This happened for four good times. The woman now said, Oh, I don't know what to do. I need to find out what is going on in my life. I need to find out what is going on. Because she visited the hospital. The doctor told her that she's perfect. Everything about her is okay. Her husband is good. Not knowing that there is an enemy outside that is getting her through her husband. <laughs> You need to be careful who you share your good news with. After I checked, I told her, you know what? This time around, after the cleansing, after the walk, please, when you are pregnant, do not tell your husband. He has made himself an enemy unknowingly. Because he doesn't even know that the problem is coming from him. Yes. On one occasion, they have casted a spell on this woman. All of her body, all over her body. Bumps. She went to the hospital. The doctor said that this is unusual. Yet, the woman was busy saying, Oh, is it that the problem is coming from my family? Is it coming from my husband's family? Maybe it's my mother-in-law. The problem was coming from her husband. You know what I told? I said, after everything, you are going to do what? Keep it as a secret. I told her the month that she will get to 
before she will tell her husband. And once you tell your husband, stop having anything to do with him intimately. She said, okay. What I taught her to do is what I am teaching you today, free of charge. Go and get me newborn baby serene from one to six weeks. From one week to six weeks. If it's more than six weeks, do not use it. A female child, the urine of a female child, a baby, a newborn baby. Get that urine. Early morning urine. If you, if it's not your child, please make sure that you tell the owner of the baby that you want to use it to break spell. Tell the woman, tell the mother the truth of what you want to use the urine for. This is a powerful ritual. You are going to be doing ritual on the altar of the baby's urine. After getting the urine, put it in a bowl. No matter how small it is, it doesn't matter. Put it in a bowl. Kneel down before that urine and start praying. Start casting. Start destroying any spell that has been casted on you. The ones you are aware of, the ones you are not aware of, in your business, in your work, workplace, in your endeavors, in your academics, in you, anything you are doing, in your house, in your shop, say that you are destroying that spell. You are removing that spell from your life today. After the prayers, you take that urine. You ensure that you state that this urine is pure. This urine is a virgin urine from a virgin baby. It has no blemishes, just as the producer of this urine. Therefore, may you make, may this urine make you whole. May this urine make you to be very pure, without blemishes. May this urine cleanse you from every negativity, from every spiritual attack, every spiritual spell, from every spiritual cause. That you are cleansing yourself using this urine, the urine of a newborn baby that does not know any sin. This baby knows no sin. This baby hasn't committed, committed anything. May this urine cleanse you. After praying, go and use the urine. Wash your face. Wash your, your, your hands. Wash your feet. That's all. You must do this between 4 a.m. to 6 a.m. Allow the urine to be in your body. You can do it by 4 a.m. and allow the urine to be in your body till 6 a.m. Before you can now go and have your bath. Dress up and go to wherever you're going to. You must repeat this exercise for three good days. For three good days. You are free. Oh yes. After the third day, check your life. Keep tab of your activities. How things have been moving and how it is now moving. Check your life and see if you are getting better now or you are getting worse. Keep record of your success because definitely you are going to be successful more than you have been. You pray that you are kneeling down before the altar that knows no sin. Before the altar that has not committed any sin. Before the altar that has not done anything that contains darkness. Before the altar, let this urine cleanse you. Make you to appear without blemishes. Make you to appear pure. Without any, any darkness in your life. You will see the power of this ritual when you are done. Whatever you want to go for, go. Have a positive mindset. It is settled. This is what helped that woman. Alright, thank you very much guys for watching. God bless you all and see you guys in my next video.